Well, friends, remember Las Vegas artist Dave Dave. He died at the age of 42 last month at a Las Vegas hospital. Dave Dave was badly scarred at the age of six when his father actually tried to burn him to death. Dave was a close friend of Michael Jackson, who he met shortly after that attack. I felt like he had like Michael Jackson's spirit in him because there were times that he even sounded like him talking and I, I it just it would just kind of blow my mind sometimes. Well, Dave Dave's cause of death is still under investigation. Rothenberg was burned and almost killed in this Buena Park motel room. He remains a patient at the UC Irvine Medical Center with third degree burns over 90% of his body. His father, Charles, is charged with attempted murder and arson. My mother divorced him. When he got out of prison, the custody battle ensued. At a certain point, my father decided that if he wasn't going to have me, nobody would. My father poured kerosene all over me. I know that he gave me a sleeping pill, that's all I remember, and then lit a match and went across the street and called the police. It was like having a million nine inch nails just put into every area of your body. I had burns over 90% of my body. I had, a, I think, a 20% chance of living past 48 hours, but I overcame those odds and as the days went by, those odds went higher and higher. I said to myself, I'm going to live, I'm going to live, I'm going to live. And we're very blessed. David joins us today, and he insists he's not a victim. He's a survivor. David, please come join us. I was going to say, I was, I'm hanging out here with two GQ studs. Look at this. <laughs> Pleasure. Look at this. Pleasure. Color coordinated, too. You know, and, and first things first, Dave, you go by Dave Dave? Yes, that's my legal name. And you changed your name after this all happened. Why? About two years ago, I changed it legally to Dave Dave uh, to liberate myself uh, from my father and to establish myself as an artist. It was kind of like an artistic decision to, to do that. That's his name, Dave Dave. He was David Rothenberg. He was set on fire in 1983, suffered, as you can see, terrible scars. Michael Jackson befriended him and paid for a lot of his surgeries. Dave Dave is also attending the burial. Why Dave Dave? Well, to liberate myself from the confines of my father's criminality, I he caused the fire? Yeah. He, he is a criminal and he uh, caused all this. To, to free myself of his name and his legacy, I decided to become my own person through changing my name. Me and he had contacted me and wanted to meet me. How old were you at the time? I was about seven years old at the time. And were you in the hospital? I was not in the hospital at the time. I was, I was in interim back and forth from surgery. And what did he do for you? Well, basically, he befriended me. He, um, he took me into his life, which is very rare for Michael to do, but he opened up his arms to me and accepted me as a very good friend of his. And throughout the years, he never let me go. He has never hurt a soul. And um, I am happy to have been his friend for all these years and been a dedicated friend. Amiko, how do you explain what Michael did for Dave Dave? That's just the kind of human being he was. He's very loving, caring. Uh, he he loved Dave from the, from the day he met him, uh, that they became friends. Uh, Michael helped him through, through the years, and that's the kind of person Michael was. I mean, he loved a lot of people. He, he'll be missed and loved by a lot of people. Did he pay for a lot of your medicals? Actually, he 
he did not pay for my medical. My mother had great insurance at the time. So Michael, what did he do? Michael offered a lot of emotional support for me. He was there for me whenever I needed to talk to him. He opened up Neverland to me as a, as a means to get away. He um, he was almost he was it, metaphorically he was almost like a father that I never had.